thank you that your blood set us free. And we are not going back, we are not turning back because what you did on the cross, that was the end, oh Lord. And we thank you that we are free. It is in Jesus' name we do pray, trust and believe. Amen. Amen and amen. Praise God, church. Praise the Lord. As we praise the Lord today, as we rejoice that He is alive and He is no longer dead, Amen. So join us as we bless the Lord and as we magnify His holy name. Let me see you clap your hands.
is the name that has power. The name that we can call and have all our answers, oh Lord. So today we exalt that name. We declare that indeed Jehovah, Jireh, Refuge, Protector, every good thing is your name, oh God.
mighty warrior, our Father, you are our great warrior this evening. And we come to your throne of grace with a lot of confidence in our hearts, oh God, appreciating you for being so gracious to us, our God. You have fought our battles, my Father. Even as we come to this month of April, dear Redeemer, we are saying thank you, God Almighty, because we have opened door generosity, my Father. Oh God Almighty, they have lifted the uplifted kingdom supplies our God. We are very grateful, my Father, because this quarter, you have brought us safely, Jehovah God Almighty, and we can only appreciate you for your goodness. Let us appreciate the Lord believers. We are here in April, the first week of April, we are here just to appreciate you, my Father, because this is the fourth month of the year of 2022, dear Redeemer. Most of us, we do not know even how we got here. But your grace has been very sufficient, our God. You have been so faithful, Jehovah God. You have been so loving, my Father. You have been so caring, Jehovah God Almighty. You have fought our battles, Jehovah God Almighty. Even as we have lifted our voices to you, dear Redeemer, praising you and saying, Jehovah, you have fought our battles, my God. And I know Oh, there are so many battles that we have crossed out along our way, Jehovah as we have come this far Jehovah God but you have fought them for us our father and each one of us I want to pray this evening dear Lord as we approach your throne my father that each one of us can look back and see the battles that Lord you have helped them to fight our God and my father we cannot even take time just to be silent we cannot be silent when we know the battles the Lord has fought for us. Some of us may have been sick, but my father, you have fought the battles, and we are well today, Jehovah. Some of us have gone through difficult situations, any storms of life. Some may have gone through financial problems, but the Lord, you have fought our battles. My father, some of us could have been going through many other challenges of life, our God. In all the storms of life, God, you have fought the battles for us, our God. And that is why we are here today, Lord, to declare that you are God, lifted on high, Redeemer, exalted on high, my Savior. And even in this time, brethren, I want to pray that we cannot be able to connect with our God, that we do not just uh, listen to the prayers that I make, but to make sure that you connect with this God. Because when there is a window of opportunity in this altar, when there is that grace, do not be bypassed by the grace of God. You can be able to lift up your voices to the Lord, and you can be able to say, thank you, Lord for the battles that he has fought for you, for all the things that the Lord has taken you through. When you thought you did not be able to say, oh, the Lord has gotten you here. And therefore, Lord Almighty, even as individuals, our God, we want to say thank you for our families. It may not have been so well with our families. I do not know what challenges the, life, the families could have been going through. But one thing that we know is God. We are here here. Even those that are online, my Father, they are there in Jehovah God Almighty, because you have carried us through King of Glory to this month of April, my Father, where you are reminding us, oh God Almighty, there is an open door, my Father of generosity, Jehovah, and therefore, Lord Almighty, we want to connect with this kingdom, dear Redeemer, the kingdom that never tries our Father. I know the times that we are living in Jehovah, it is sometimes very tough, our God. We know many people can be, could be challenged financially, and because we know, my Father, our economy 
economy is not dictated by the economy of this world, God. We want to say, King Jesus, may you help us to connect with the kingdom of generosity of the open door, dear Redeemer, so that we can be able to say indeed, uh, you are our supplier, my Father. As long as we seek the kingdom of God, my Father, then all these things, other things can be added unto us, our Father. We pray that, Lord Almighty, you may remove us from the spirit of grumbling. Sometimes we are caught up in grumbling, my Father. Instead of giving thanks to you, Jehovah, we are repenting, my God, uh, where we have complained and murmured, Jehovah, because when we know the spirit of murmuring and grumbling, Lord, it's the spirit that makes you feel unhappy with us, God. Forgive us, my Father. We know the children of Israel, dear Redeemer, when they walked in the wilderness, my Father, because of the spirit of grumbling and mumbling, Jehovah, they spent many years that they shouldn't have spent our God. And the Redeemer, they, they faced many challenges, our God. Therefore, Redeemer, I want to pray, my Father, as I stand even on behalf of your beloved children this evening, that, Lord, if there is somewhere we have been murmuring, if there is somewhere we have been complaining our God without seeing your goodness in the land of the living our Father may you forgive us oh God cleanse our hearts, our thoughts, our mind that we may learn to seek you beyond anything else my Father because when we seek you with all our hearts our God we will be able to find you our Father and our God we want to bless you Jehovah God Almighty because we know dear Redeemer our Father uh, gold and silver belongs to you, my God. And there is nothing that is too hard for you, my Father. And therefore, Lord Almighty, my Savior, my God, I pray for your children in this month, my Father, of open door generosity, that as they knock, my God and my Savior, to this door, King of glory, which already you are the door, my Father. Let them find all that they desire, my God. Let them find all that there is within in your reach, my Father, because there is plenty of faith, my Father, in your kingdom. And I pray, Jehovah God Almighty, those who are seeking whatever they are seeking, dear Redeemer, as they seek the kingdom of God, my Father, then, dear Redeemer, these other things, oh God, you are able to answer, my God. You said, you tell us, oh God Almighty, to call on you, my Father, in our time of need, dear Redeemer, and you will minister to us, our God, our Father and our Savior, when we come to your sanctuary, my God, sometimes we come with the many baggages, our God, and these are the ones that we are releasing to you. We may not be able to mention each one of them, dear Lord, but as individuals, beloved of the Lord, mention that with that heartache in you, that which you brought to the house of the Lord, that which you say, God, if only you could remember me in this area, I am challenged. May the Lord see your cry this evening. Just turn to him because, because he is telling us tonight to call on him and to seek him when we can seek him with all our hearts. Then we are able to find him and he is able to answer our, our, our questions. He is able to answer all those things that we are we are asking in our hearts, Lord. In our madness, my Father. I know there are those who are even have questions, my God. Because of the bereavement, oh God Almighty, I pray my Savior and my God, anyone, my Father, that is hearing my voice, and they are bereaved tonight, our God. How I pray for your strength the Jehovah. How I pray for peace that surpasses every human understanding. My Father, we may not understand the pain, but you, God, that understands King of glory, minister to your children, O oh God, for the glory of your name, my Father. May you, dear Redeemer, comfort them with the comfort that you are alone. You comfort your children with our Father. We bless you. We give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, my Father. We want to thank you, Jehovah God Almighty. We are in a season where our children are our home, dear Redeemer. My Father, we know King of glory. There is sometimes a lot
lot of challenges in our technologies, in our media platforms. How I pray, my God and our Savior, you may secure our children, our Father, in your own way, King of glory, when they are left, oh my Father, secure their borders, our God, uh, that, Lord, they will not be lured into the wrong direction, my Father. Spirit of the living God, uh, watch over our children, our Father, watch over our young people, my Father. May you, dear Lord Almighty, carry them through, my God and my Savior. Even when the parents and the guardians are away, let them always remember that, dear Lord, you are watching over them. And that, Lord, they will not do things that are not right, my Father. They will not be lured to watch things that are not right, our God. Secure the borders of our children. We want to thank you for Paki family, Jehovah, that my God and my Savior, they have a program for our children, that they are not just staying home, King of glory, but they have somewhere they come and learn about you, God. I pray that my Father, my Savior, you may cause parents and guardians, the Redeemer, to bring their children, oh my Father, so that they can be able, King of glory, this season to connect with you, my God, and to connect with one another, Jehovah, so that they can be able to sharpen themselves, O oh God Almighty, to sharpen one another, dear Redeemer, as they continue growing up, our Father. We want to thank you and to bless you, King of glory. Even for the body of Christ, Parklands Baptist Church, oh God. We want to pray for the leadership of this, of this church, Jehovah God Almighty. We want to bring my Father, my God, the counsel before you, God Almighty. We bring the PDB before your throne of grace. The board of trust is my Father. We want to bless you, my Father, even for the departments and the ministry leaders, oh God. Faithful Savior, we want to thank you, my Father, for all the pastors, my God, that you are put in charge of the congregation. And even my Father, our senior pastor and the associate Jehovah, as I continue leading this congregation, my Father, redeem, I pray that the Spirit of God shall be upon them in this season, Jehovah, that they may release that which is in your heart at all time, oh God. And that, my Father, you may use them, my God, as the verse of your kingdom, Jehovah. Even as we continue enhancing this gospel, my Father, I pray that none of us in this congregation, dear Redeemer, that we will, not, that we will be left behind, my Father, because you have called each one of us, my God. Oh God Almighty, to be able to take the gospel out there, King of glory. Thank you, my Father and our God, that wherever you have blessed us, my Father, you want us to be the, the salt of the earth and the light of the world, oh God Almighty. And that, Lord, we may not light our lamps and hand, put them under the, the, the bed, oh dear Redeemer, but we all put them up, oh God Almighty, that they can shine our light, my Father upon them all that are around us, O God Almighty. And by this, my Father, we will be known to be our disciples, our Father. And Lord Almighty, we pray, King of glory, wherever you place us, O God Almighty, in the marketplace, my Father, in our neighborhood, O God Almighty, we ask that the Spirit of the Lord shall stand with us, O God Almighty. My Savior and our God, we want to pray, dear Redeemer, as we remember the sake tonight, oh God, we want to remember our sister Joy Washira, my father. We are connecting our faith together, dear Redeemer, that you may minister your healing upon her life this evening, oh God. And we are no dear Redeemer. You are a healer, you are a deliverer. And my father, my God, as we are thinking of the cross of Calvary, my father, and that you rose, my God, and we are rejoicing in your resurrection my father and that the old is gone and the new has come my father this is the god of resurrection that we are calling upon the life of joy my father and many others dear redeemer if there is anyone dear redeemer that is in our mind is the jehovah let them tap into the anointing of the healing of the lord because whenever we come to you dear redeemer you will not forsake us oh god he will answer our prayers our Father, because you are faithful, God. Thank you, merciful Savior.
Hallelujah. Thank you, our God. King, you are from everlasting to everlasting, oh God. And we continue to declare you alone as God. Thank you, faithful Savior. We worship you in adoration, God Almighty. As we think of our nation, oh God Almighty, this evening, King Jesus, we worship you because, Lord Almighty, you are God. We bless you, God. We give you praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Come as so known. 
the praise. We continue to give you all the honor, Jehovah God Almighty. We continue to lift up your name, O God Almighty, and to say you are the beginning and the end, our Father and our God. As we are so excited, my Father, because you are the beginning and the end of everything, my Father, we can be able to place everything that we need from you, Jehovah, and we can be able to say, you are God that is lifted on high, my Father. We can be able to say you are God that is exalted on high. Because there is nothing that is impossible with you, Jehovah. Because, my God, with men things are impossible, but with you, dear Redeemer, there is nothing that is impossible, King of glory. And even as we come to your throne of grace, my Father, to continue saying that you are God, you are God forevermore. Lifted on high forevermore. We also want to bring our nation of Kenya before you, God. As we think of this wonderful nation that you have given to us, our Father, we are indebted, dear Redeemer, to, so you, to know that, Lord, your goodness and mercy has worked with us, O God Almighty, over the years, King of glory. But sometimes, Lord of glory, we have looked down on ourselves. My Father, sometimes, God Almighty, the Spirit has also continued to grumble in this nation, my Father, without realizing what a great God that you are, King Jesus. And for this reason, my Father, we want to repent where we have grumbled of our nation. We want to pray, King of glory. Where my father, many a times, Jehovah God Almighty, we have grumbled over the economy. We have grumbled over our leaders, our father. We have grumbled over the way the nation is going without knowing that my father the only thing that we can be able to do and is to bring this nation before your throne of grace and that is why we are praying my God as we repent each one of us where we have fallen short of the glory of God by not praying for this nation I repent on behalf of all those that dear Redeemer are following up this service Jehovah tonight and we are saying, King of glory, we have talked to you of our nation. We have talked to you of our leaders. We have talked to you, my father, of the economy of this nation. We have talked to you of anything to do with this nation, God. And for this reason, my father, we even need to be judged, my God. But we are repenting, God Almighty. Because when you remind us, oh God Almighty, that this nation is, the government of this nation is on your shoulders, our God. We can rest assured, my Father, whatever promises that you have made for our nation, God. Ah, yes, and amen, King Jesus. We only need King Jesus to walk with you, my Father, lifting up our leaders to you, Jehovah. We bless our president, our God. We want to bless my Father, even the vice president. We bless all the governors of this nation, Jehovah. All the senators, all the MCS, oh Jehovah. All Redeemer, every leader. And my Father, we are also leaders. Wherever we are, King of glory, my Father, I pray that the spirit of excellence may be upon us, God, that in whatever we do, Jehovah, we may be able to do that which is in your heart. Because my Father, many a times, God, we get ashamed when we get to know that this nation, my my father, the majority are Christians, Lord. Yet, my father, we do things that that are not right with you, God. And for this reason, I repent for each one of, God, of us, oh God. My Father, where we have been corrupt, where we have practiced injustice, Lord, where we have invaded, dear Master, where we have stolen, my Father, where we have done so many evil things, my God, that have not warranted us any blessing as a nation. We repent, King of glory, and we pray, my Father, my God, that you may help our our nation's leaders, oh God Almighty, to help us in the leadership, King of glory. Wherever anyone is placed, my God, let us bring the glory that it requires our Father. My Father, especially as believers, God, whenever you give us any dockets, my Father, you want us to shine 
shine in that area, God, so that favor can locate us, God, so that the spirit of excellence can be in us like in Daniel, God, and so that when everyone is looking for a man, dear Redeemer, or a woman even to take to another level, my Father, we can be the people that can get that favor, King of Glory. But if we are not committed into doing that which is right, Lord, then these things can bypass us, God, and we can continue murmuring our God. Therefore, Lord, we continue to say, my Savior, be lifted, dear Redeemer, be exalted in our nation, King of glory. We pray for every part of this nation, Lord. We are in the season of the short rains, our God. We are asking that, my Father, you may give us moderate rains, so that, dear Redeemer, we can have... The, the, the rains that will give us food, my Father. We are not, uh, we are refusing any rains, my God, that may bring any destruction in our nation, our God. We know, my Father, my God, uh, uh, a Saturday or so ago, my Father, Sunday, it rained heavily, my Father, and my, a number of people, my God, it did not go well with them, Jehovah. Some lost their homes, others, my Father, life, so God, we pray for moderate rain, so Jehovah, God Almighty, so that we can have a harvest, the King of glory, and we are declaring that, my Father, and our God, our nation will continue to enjoy the peace that the Lord Almighty you, you do want us to enjoy King of glory. Faithful Savior, we want to pray, dear Master, even as we continue standing for our nation, Jehovah God Almighty, we want to pray for our neighboring countries, King Jesus, you have told us to pray, my God Almighty, even for other nations, oh God Almighty, how I pray, dear Redeemer, you may remember Uganda, Jehovah God. You may remember Tanzania, Jehovah. You may remember the Arisi King Jesus, Burundi, and even Rwanda, my father. So marry Jehovah God Almighty and other nations, oh God Almighty, that are surrounding us, oh God. Because we know the Redeemer when we are enjoying peace, our God, and others are not enjoying that are near us, oh God. We may not be able to enjoy the same peace, Lord. Therefore, we ask for your peace as a passes every human understanding may be upon the nations of the world, oh God. We remember you, uh, you Russia and you Ukraine, our God. My Father, it is sometimes like we are forgotten, yet it is not well, King of glory. May you continue, my Father, my God, to release the peace that surpasses every human understanding, oh God, to those nations, that if they may coexist with the peace with one another, Jehovah. Lord, we pray for Israel and the Palestinian, oh God. My Father, my God, I pray there is nobody that you have created, my Father, on the face of the earth as a problem to each other, God. We are supposed to love one another, dear Redeemer, because for every human being, it is you that has created, my Father, each and every one of us, O oh God Almighty. So, Redeemer, the best thing that we can do, God, is see the good of each other, my Father, so that we can love each one, one another, dear Lord. We pray, King of glory wherever you have blessed us my father that we can love one another Jehovah so that even the other people can see dear redeemer as Christians we love one another my God almighty then we can also be known to be our disciples our God we want to thank you my father we want to bless you Jehovah God almighty as we continue in this service King Jesus may you continue to speak to us our God you do not gather your children in vain my father Father, whenever you bring us together, my God, you want us to hear from you, God. And when we hear, my Father, you want us to hearken to that word. As your word comes, it comes each and every Wednesday, my Father. Let us not take it, my God, for granted. Let us work for it with it, O oh God. And let us work for us, my Father, because your word 
is sharper than a double-edged sword, my Father, that it pierces the bone and the marrow, my Father. And dear Lord, it is able even to shape our hearts, O oh God, to the way you do want us to be King of glory. Therefore, we want to thank you even as the man of God, as Ambrose brings your word. My Father, I pray that your word may come with the clarity that we can be able to understand, Lord Almighty, and to continue enjoying in the faithfulness of the Lord our God. We want to thank you for the warmth of each other, my Father, my God, this night evening, O oh God, and let the Spirit of the Lord continue to minister to us, our God. We thank you and bless you, King Jesus. We give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory. And in Jesus' name, we do pray with thanksgiving. Amen. Let us appreciate the Lord. Appreciate this King of Kings. He fights our battles and he makes us victorious. Hallelujah. Praise God. Are you happy to be in the house of the Lord? Are you happy? I don't see the happiness. Yes. Yes, I can see you are happy to be in the house of the Lord. Mwabariki sana for choosing to be here in first second gathering, right? Now I go online to now Penda. Thank you for being there. You can have your seats. Asante sana. Um, I would want to acknowledge in case we have a visitor today. Any visitor somewhere? Someone locating a visitor somewhere by a show of hand? Akuna mgeni? Okay, online. If there is any visitor online, ama kuna ya apa. Apa kuna. Online, if you are there, kindly shout out to us and we will be able to reach out to you. But we welcome each and every one of us in the house of our Father. And thank you for choosing to come here. Naona tunaendelea kuongezeka in the evening service. May the grace of God continue to abound. And even to those that are online, we love you. And we thank God for each one of you and for choosing to follow. And even those who will be following later, we also want to thank God for each one of you. I just got like only two announcements. This week, what has been happening this week? This week, prayer and fasting. Oh, you begin my coffee. And have you been praying and fasting? Oh, praying and feasting. Anyway, we pray that God has given you at least a day to be able to pray and to fast because we are committing this coming quarter and um, before the you know the hands of God so that He can work with us in this next quarter. Praise the Lord. And so um, we still have tomorrow and Friday to go. And then Friday is what? Kesha, who is coming for the Kesha? Em, could you Kesha? I love to end the wedding here, Pastor Maxi Sawa. Yeah, the Pastor Maxi's wedding is on Saturday, on Saturday. And I pray we can continue praying for him, our youth pastor, and also giving where we can be able to support him and we give God glory for that. Um, and now, um, I want to call us into a time of giving. Woo! Hey! You guys, you need to be shouting because this is all what we can do best. We are in the month of what? What is the, the, the theme of this month? Open door. Uh -huh. Uplifted kingdom supply. So we want to trust God. This is the meaning of the month. Praise God. This month, I want to test the Lord. So let us test, you know, the Lord. That is what Malachi says. We test the Lord and see if you will not open the floodgates of heaven. And I'm sure we will get all that we desire. So even as we, we give, we, we are in this month of open door generosity. Let us be generous in every way. Not only generous in our giving, but generous in every way, in smiling to others, in being happy in the presence of God, in loving other people, 
whatever thing that you think it is generous, give it out to someone for the glory of God. And so I want to give us um, our giving details are there as usual. We have pay bill 80, 90, 900, and the account is um, name is tithe and offering. And then there is also M-Pesa link that is available in our social media platform and in our website. We also have direct bank transfers to our account, Stand Big Bank, Wayakiwe, and the account is 01. Double zero double zero double zero four nine eight two three two, and the bank code is S B I C K E N X. And then there is also online giving um, through PayPal at uh, it is parklandsbaptist.org. That is if you are giving online, and if there are checks, you can do your checks. And anytime I keep saying it is giving. All the time, because the ministry of Parklands Baptist Church goes on and on and on. And uh, we are also so open to receiving all the time so that the ministry will never suffer. In case you want to bring late offering or you are coming to church to pray and you want to bring your gift, don't say, this is not a Sunday, this is not a Wednesday, I do not know, I don't want to go to the account. There are boxes along the exit. You can always drop your offerings there, your checks, and whatever giftings that you have brought into the house of the Lord. We are also saying we have a PDQ machine uh, that is available at our reception. Those who do want to swipe also, you can uh, go and swipe there anytime because it is at the uh, reception there. And uh, also we have our uh, cash. Uh, those who also love giving in cash, our ushers, I believe they are somewhere. Ushers, are we ready? Yes, they are somewhere. They are saying they are ready. The baskets are here. We are going to pray and then to allow the, um, the, the giving of the gift as we also go to welcome the man of God, our senior pastor, so that he can come to break the bread of life for us this evening. Let us pray. Our Father and our God, we thank you very much that you always love us so much, Lord. When we just think of the work of the cross, we can never thank you enough, Lord. And sometimes even when we come to just to present very little kidoko of what you have given to us, our God, sometimes we feel that it is, can never be enough because you have given us so, so much, Lord. And yet, Lord Almighty, you appreciate that which we give. Sometimes we bring in the name of um, tithe, in the name of our uh, offering. Sometimes, Lord, we are bringing in thanksgiving because of you have done something for us. Lord, sometimes we also give in, in terms of the talents that you have given to us, my Father. We don't despise any, any gift that you have given to us, my Father, that we would be bringing in the house of the Lord. And therefore, Lord, we want to say thank you for every giving that will happen this evening. Jehovah God Almighty, may you receive all our giftings, my Father, in form of money, cash, checks, whatever it is, my Father, receive them, my God, so that they can be used for the extension of the kingdom, my Father, because we know the ministry of Paki, my God, we can never go wrong, my Father, because we know the many lives that we touch, my Father, each and every day of our lives, my Father. Therefore, Lord, bless your children, bless your people, our Father, as they give King of glory. There is none of them that will, or none of us, my Father, that we will go lacking in any way, Jehovah. I pray that, dear Redeemer, you may open the floodgates of heaven for each one, my Father. And because they are refreshing, those that need our ministry, our God, may also we be refreshed, our Father, for the glory of your name. We give you all the praise, and even as we bless our our pastor, our senior pastor, as brings uh, the word uh, to us, our God, we pray that, Lord Almighty, you may give him, my Father, that word for the season for us. And I want to believe we will be blessed tonight. We give you all the praise, all the honor, and all the glory in Jesus' name. 
Amen, amen. God bless you. And let us just appreciate these wonderful guys and the band and every one of us that has made this service uh, a success today. May the Lord bless you and give you all that you need because you served him today. God bless you.